While there's no doubt that GarageBand on Mac is first and foremost an audio-focused program, it is called a digital audio workstation after all. It does allow you to import, edit and add music to movie clips as well. Here's how it works. First things first, you're going to need to get your hands on some footage to add music to. If you have your own footage that you've perhaps filmed yourself, great. If not, or if you just want to try how this works out for yourself, you can bring in royalty-free movie clips from websites like Pexels.com and Pixabay.com, or even AI-generated movie clips if you really want to. GarageBand only allows you to bring in one movie clip per project. So if you have multiple clips you want to put together, you'll need to do that in other editing software first, and then bring it into GarageBand to add a soundtrack. A super duper simple way to do this is to use iMovie, another completely free Apple made program that's probably already installed on your Mac actually. Here's a quick crash course. First open iMovie, if you don't have it installed, download it for free from the Mac App Store. Create a new project by selecting create new and then selecting movie from the menu. Click on import media in the my media section. Navigate to where your files are stored on your Mac. Mine are in Mac HD, my name and downloads. Select multiple by holding the command key on your typing keyboard. Select the files, then click on import all. From here, you can drag and drop your clips into iMovie's timeline in whatever order you want. Note that if you have some clips that are a different aspect ratio than you require, click on the crop icon here then select Crop to Fill and move the frame to your desired position. You can go all in on different transitions, text and effects if you want, but I'm going to keep this really simple. Next, click on File in the toolbar, Share, then File. Fill out the info as required. Hit Next, then choose where the movie will save to. Hit export and you'll get a notification when it's done. Whatever flavour of movie footage you have, getting it into GarageBand is really straightforward. Locate your file, my edited file is on my desktop. Then with the GarageBand window open, simply drag and drop it in. Dragging and dropping the movie file opens GarageBand's movie track and gives you a preview of your imported movie as well. You can get rid of the preview window by clicking the button in the top left, and you can bring it back again by clicking on the thumbnail in the movie tracks header. Once your movie file is imported, you can go ahead and add music to it. I want something quite spacey and ethereal, so I'll go ahead and load up some patches from, surprise surprise, the Alpha Waves sound pack. Then I'll add in a little bit of rhythm. And some extra wee bits to finish it off. Here's how it sounds all together. And 
that actually sounds pretty good. Once you're done, head to File in the toolbar, hover over Movie, and select Export Audio to Movie. In the box that pops up, you'll be able to name your exported movie, choose where it exports to, and change the quality of the exported movie file. Hit save when done, and once exported, your fully soundtracked movie will be available to play. Soundtracking your own movies in GarageBand is great fun and really straightforward. Another thing that's really straightforward is creating your own instruments in GarageBand for Mac. Watch this next to find out how to do that. <laughs> 